Hey guys, it's Seth here, and today I'm gonna show you guys how to make an um, alarm using music um, with no program. So, first thing you wanna do is gonna wanna go to your notepad, and then you're just gonna wanna go file. Make sure you go file. Make sure you don't close this um, and save as. Oh, by the way, um, this will work for Windows 7, I believe. This is the same for um, Windows XP and Vista. Only the last step may be different. Um, if you're a Mac user, I'm sorry. Um, look up on Google. Let's see. Um, alarm using iTunes. Uh, I think that I think that would work. But um, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to save it as um, just basically anything, so you remember it's your alarm. So my space alarm dot bat make sure you put like make sure the extension is dot bat you gotta have the dot bat extension um and then the first thing you want to do is you're gonna want to put at echo off then you're gonna want to put the um extension to your song that you want to use so um for me mine is i'm just not gonna create a new folder uh mine is parasite by disturb so um i'm not gonna play it by the way because i want to get copyrights um so what you're gonna want to do is you just gotta want to click here and then this will all be highlighted press Control c and then you're gonna want to go back into your notepad and press Control v and now what you're gonna want to do is i believe right here um you're gonna want to just hit enter i can't remember if it's right here or right here I think it's right here though. Um, and then you're gonna want to put um, CD and then slash D there, and then same thing here, CD um, slash D, and then um, crap. Actually, I think it is the other way. I do not know. I just don't know. Okay, I have right the first time. Um, so. Then what you're going to want to do is you're going to, going to want to go back to this folder and then just um, get the song name, so control C. And then you're going to want to hit enter and then hit control V. Make sure to put the extension of the song, so put that, for me it's that mp3. You're just going to want to put quotes around this. And that's it for that, so then go to the file, save. And then what you're gonna want to do is you for this is for Windows Seven. Um, this is called um, I don't remember what it's called, but um, you're gonna want to go start, go to Control Panel. Um, why am I here? Then you're gonna want to go to System and Security, Administrative Tools. Then you're gonna want to go to Task Schedule. I believe for um, Windows yeah Vista XP. You're gonna want to just search it or run it, but um. I don't know, I do not have a Windows XP or Vista, I have Windows 7. So, you're going to double click on this. What time is it? just want to see what time it is. Okay, then you're going to want to click Create a Basic Task. So let's just click that. And then you're going to want to name it, so let's just name it My Freaking Alarm. Because, you know, I get mad when stuff wakes me up. Then trigger, um, daily, monthly, blah, 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 blah. Um, so, I'm going to keep it daily because I want this to wake me up in the morning. Um, not really, though, because I already made one. Then you're going to want to click next. Then action. Um, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to set a start time for this to happen. So I am going to set this at not a freaking... Um, I'll set this at 7.10, that should be enough time, um, actually I'll set to 7.8, I should still be enough time to finish this, and then I can just fast forward it to when the thing starts playing. Um, then, action, I forgot to tell you guys, um, the reason why you want to make it a dot .bat file is because when you double click on it, it will open this command prompt. Yeah, I hope I don't get copyright for that one little note, but I'll open a command prompt, and then it will open the song. So, yeah, that's what that does. Um, then action, start, start program, make sure it's on that, then next, then program and script. So, you're going to browse, and then you're going to find that, can we sort it? No, we can't. Okay, so then you're going to want to find your um, bat file. 
Um, what is it? My alarm. Here we go. And then you gotta want to click next, and now just tell you all the information here. Click finish, and that's it. So basically, what this will do now is um, it will open the, it will open your alarm at the time you set. I set mine to 7:08, so um, I'm going to. I guess fast forward it until the thing plays because I like fast forwarding. It's only going to be another minute. Well, actually, um, 7.30 and then 30 seconds, whatever. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to speed it up. Okay, so, two, one, and then it will open. And then, as you can see, the song did open, so... Yeah, that's basically how to make an alarm using music. And uh, my bull and if you wanna get rid of it, what you're gonna wanna do is you're just gonna wanna right click and delete um the file. Say yes. Make sure you don't lose that file. It's just always gonna open. And then you're just gonna want to empty your recycling bin, and then it won't be there. So um. Windows won't be able to find the program, so it will not be able to open, and you that, and then you can just set a new alarm. And also, if you want to um, change your song at any time, you can just right-click the your thing and then hit edit, and then you can change it um, however you like. So yeah, the only things that you would need to change are maybe this and this. But what I would do is I would just just to save time, I would open the folder and put a new song in there. Um, now I think about it, I should have used a, Ke a freaking Kevin MacLeod song, but whatever. So guys, I hope this um, helped you. Um, and also, I recommend if you're using this as a long to like, get up or something, oh, freaking blesses, um, then have some speakers, because are you really going to sleep with your headphones on? And if you're going to sleep with your headphones on, are they really going to stay on? <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Well, not enjoyed. This helped you. Remember to comment, rate, subscribe. It helps me out a lot. My name is Seth, 00015, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!